What we got here is a straight up unboxing of a box. What's he unboxing? What it be? Well, I don't know. Shut up and see. Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. A while back, I unboxed a copy of a signed edition of If It Bleeds by Stephen King. Now I got tipped off to that a rare, awesome opportunity to get a signature by a good friend of mine. I let that friend down um, when it came to Jaws. I should have been on top of it. I should have been reminding him that the chatter was that the July release was going to be Jaws and he should be paying attention, perhaps getting ready to buy, getting on top of it. Um, but I, I, didn't, I, didn't, uh, I didn't give him the heads up the same way he gave me the heads up. So I apologize for that. I'm sorry I let him down. This good friend of mine tipped me off to this book, um, and I apologize if you if you're if you're watching this man. Sorry if you're not. I don't I don't blame you, but maybe word will get around to you that I apologize on the channel. I don't know. Anyway, so right after I got the copy of If It Bleeds, I went to the Cemetery Dance website and ordered a copy of. I ordered uh, a slipcase. They make slipcases for Stephen King books. They always do. I think they got one going for Billy Summers. I know they're going to have one for later. Or Levidian's going to have one for later. So I went to them and um, and, and bought one. I, I mean, I paid for one. I ordered one. Um, but it, it got here today. And I bought it back in May of 2020. So I've seen pictures. These slipcases look awesome. I have one for my signed copy of Sleeping Beauties, the trade edition. And there's no doubt Cemetery Dance does quality work um, on these Stephen King books. Just really top notch. This slipcase looks awesome. If you have a signed Stephen King trade edition and you don't have it in a slipcase, then just send it to me and I will get a slipcase for it and, and store it properly and I'll send you pictures of it every holiday and, and let you know how it's doing on my shelf at an undisclosed location. But you could just sleep at night knowing your baby is tucked in bed and safe and sound. So that's an open invitation for everybody to send me signed Stephen King books. So let's get into it. Let's talk to the Dragon Lord. Oh, you know what? I'm sorry, Duff Bucket. You've got something for me, don't you? Don't you, Duff Bucket? Yes, I do. Oh, I didn't know Duff Bucket had a voice. What do, you, what do you have for me, Magic Duff Bucket? What the shit is this? A press? Lime and lemongrass? Duff Bucket, you're punishing me for forgetting. Forgetting you, aren't you? I, I mean, do I look like a lime and lemongrass? Uh, seltzer water? Wait, wait. Um, premium alcohol seltzer. Do I look like that guy? I gotta try it now. Not looking forward to this. Okay, you know when you're, when your bar is low and your expectations are low, you can't get disappointed as you know as severely. Which is like what I want you to remember every time you click on a, a Jeff Word video. Keep them expectations low. This ain't gonna go up on a Sun Tough shelf. We'll put that over there. Now we'll get the Dragon Lord involved. We'll withdraw him from the sheath. Sheath. Uh, in case you didn't know this, I usually wear this on my hip, on my belt, and I got a, I tie it around my thigh, and I walk around with Dragon Lord in a holster, and I've gotten quite a reputation among uh, the local police department. So let's get into this. And uh, I'm doing it like this. I'm unboxing it um, all on camera because it's a slipcase, you know. I don't know if you need me to do the overhead thing to see all the details because there are not many details to see. I don't, I don't have a signature show or illustrations. Let's see. Let's see what we net here. 
Okay. Packing slip. Ah, oh, that's a nice looking slip case. If I didn't know better, I'd say it was the book. They've done a fantastic job matching. Wow. Oh, that, that seltzer water is giving me gas bubbles. I guess gas bubbles is better than... AFib? I don't know. So they stuff little styrofoam to keep the shape of the slipcase. This is nice. This is quality. This is quality slipcase territory. Um, feels very nice. Uh, I don't know if they still have any available, but uh, I mean, it is nice. Even if you don't have a signed edition of this book, it's nice to have this. No? I mean, I... I think it'd be cool. I mean, I don't need to slipcase all my trade edition uh, Stephen King books. It's just not. It's just not my bag. But if you were somebody who did, I wouldn't judge you harshly. We could be friends still. We could, okay. So let's see. Here's the slipcase, and that's the gaping hole that you cram the book in. I saw a piece of styrofoam in there in the playback uh let me feel the oh that's it's, it's material inside too and there's the there's the title so stephen king if it bleeds let's just compare look at that that looks cool doesn't that look cool um but of course a slip case can only be judged by how well it fits the book that's that's like that's its only job so you know I like it. I, I like it. I like it better than the dust jacket. Uh, the the color, the tone of that. I like it better than the dust jacket. So let's see. So this is this is like the moment of truth. I feel like Ryan Seacrest delaying the results of American Idol. Now now that's a good fit. Now that's what I call a good fit. It would probably be a little more snug if you had. Um, a Brodart Mylar protective cover, it probably would still fit. It would be obviously a little snug, a little more snug, a little more snugger. Um, and I, for one, I tried to put the Brodart on my books, but I mangle the dust jackets. I, I just don't do that good of a job, so I don't do it. Um, but that's nice. That's really nice. Good job, Cemetery Dance. I, I, I'm, I'm a happy guy. Uh, this is an expensive book now. Uh, Stephen King doesn't sign too many of these. And again, I'd like to thank my friend who gave me um, the tip off on this book. And I'll pay you back, man. Uh, I'll try to find a way to make it right. <sighs> so many good guys out there. So many people I owe. Um, and when I'm in a position to pay people back, uh, I, you know, I just got to try gotta try so anyway check it out if uh if you also have a signed edition or you just want to protect your trades your first editions and make them a little extra special get over to cemetery dance i don't know if they're still in stock but they're shipping now so you don't have to wait um you know years so that that's this unboxing um again set your expectations low and you won't be disappointed stay frosty Like and subscribe or watch another video. Like and subscribe or watch another video. Like and subscribe or watch another video or subscribe or subscribe or subscribe.